I'm going to be getting United fans' perspective on their 3-0 loss against Liverpool. Let's see what they have to say for themselves and about their football club. Martin. Take, follow up, follow up, follow up. Martin. Hello? Chat yeah. to me. Yeah, it's just it's just a poor performance, man. Casemiro needs to go after this season. Why? What, what happened? What happened, Casemiro? What did Casemiro do? He costed us two goals, man. He's just it's... trying to he's trying to do too much. I mean, I mean, he did cost you two goals. I hear that. I let that. I understand. But is it not the manager, the tactics? What went wrong? Or they just Casemiro? It wasn't just Casemiro. Like it was just everyone's performance. Like the defenders. Uh -huh. You can give Delit Delit had a good debut. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I can't hate this thing, but the hate watch was successful today. Z um, Zorsky, he didn't really do too much. He should have scored them goals. He had an open True. goal a couple he of did. times. He did. He did. So, hold maybe up. It is, maybe it is the new players trying to fit into Ten Hag's tactics. i got a question. i got a question. i got one question yeah. before I get a new person in. So i got two mm -hmm. questions, actually. Yeah. Where will United finish this season? The way they're playing now, I'm going 5th, 6th. Okay, cool. Should Ten Hag be fired? After the season, this is his last season. Okay, cool. So Ten Hag should go. After the season, yeah, he's gone. Okay, then I appreciate you, my boy. Hey, head up, man, head up. The dark yeah, days are still man. coming. Yeah, I know, man. Bro. Hey, 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 bro, it's sad. Oh, yo. Bailey, first of all, are you following yeah. my TikTok, Twitch, and YouTube? Yeah. Okay, say no more, say no more. Okay, hold on. What was my latest YouTube video I just posted? Don't know, bro. Yeah, hey, don't wait. It's okay. Oh, he left. Oh, he left. Yo. I see you just follow me on Twitch, brother. So I've got you in. I already know you're following my Twitch. Yeah, yeah. You've subbed to the YouTube. Uh, I'm going to do it now, but you invited me. Yeah, so. don't, no, don't worry. Right, listen, I know, I know. Don't worry, I know. I got a question, brother. I got a question, brother. Yeah, yeah. What is the problem with your team? Yeah. What was your thoughts Casimiro. on that game? Oh, oh, so you're just going to blame Casemiro? Casemiro. So Casemiro is the wholeheartedly and entirely to blame for what took place today. Not the tactics, not the manager, not your attackers, not your defenders. I mean, to be fair, your your CDM decided to give the ball away numerous times. One, he got fouled, but you know. So what's wrong? What happened? I think Ten Hag sometimes needs to sub on the younger players first, innit? Because they're that, trying to make did. a name for themselves. He, he said he, what, what, no, why like did he, earlier on. They signed a Collier. What more do you want? He subbed them on my half time. How much earlier do you want it to get? No, like at the start of the game, because they're gonna try three times as harder to actually make a name for themselves. Listen, did the better team win today? Yes. Okay. I have two questions, brother. I'm gonna ask the same person. I say ask the same question to the last guy. Where will United finish this season? Uh, six or seventh. Oh. So where's all the United fans that said they're going to finish top four? Where did they go? Where are they? Where did they go? Cool. My last, uh, my other question. Should Ten Hag be fired? Wait until December. If he's still playing, if he's still doing shit, then just get, get him off. Is it, is it get panic, is it panic stations at Manchester United Football Club? Hmm. Yes. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Listen. Head up, man. you got a lot of life left to live. Don't think about United too much. I've been there, done that. I, the, hey, the dark days are over at the Emirates. Yeah. All right, next person. Next person. United fans only. If you're not a United fan, please. I'm not talking to United. Non-United fans, I'm not talking to you. I want to hear United fans only. So follow up. 45 more people in here. Follow up. This is a United space. It's a United space. We're doing therapy. Hold up. This is therapy for United fans. Welcome in, United fans. Your team currently lost 3-1 with hosting therapy. Talk to me. I will listen to your problems. This is a safe space. Send this to your friends that are United fans. It's a safe space. Let it out. Make sure you're on my Twitch as well. Chat to me, brother. Yes, G. So what team do you support? Liverpool. Oh, uh, you know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? I will let, I will let it slide. I will let it slide brother i said united fans only but at this occasion i will let it slide how we doing today i'm feeling good bro hey hey on the slot ball what we thinking sick bro we're gonna win the champions league everything bro huh i let you in you had your fun anything you would like to say before i terminate your ass what do you want to say you're not you're not gonna get relegated soon oh uh, you relegated hold yeah. up what's your thoughts ten hog 
What about what's your thoughts on Ten Hag? Ten Hag, you might need to get him out. Get him out? Oh dear. Is that bad? That bad, man. Oh dear. Hey, you said you said it here first, Ten Hag. Hey, Liverpool. Liverpool are cooking. They have yet to concede a, a goal this year. Yes, sir. Hey, well, hold up. That's two goals in the first game, two goals in the second game, three here. They are cooking. Seven goals. No goals are conceded. Yo, yo, yo. Can you hear me? Yeah, bro. Come on, the Reds. Bro. Chat to me. It's what? fine. It's fine. We, we, What's fine? We got a new signing. We're here. We're coming. We're coming. Just Where are you? Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where are you going? Where am I going? Where are you going? I'm going to win Europa. I'm going to win Carabao. I'm going to win FA Cup. Uh, playing like the way I just saw? Bro, we're not fully strong yet. We have no Luke Shaw still. But uh, does Luke, Luke Shaw don't exist. He's a facade. Ignore him. Yeah, right back and left back. Let's really think about this. They can uh, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, hey, let, me, let me think about a club that does that. Arsenal. Arsenal. Timba. Timba. Tomiyasu. 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 But also, it's a different caliber. You guys compete for second place, so it's a different. It's no, a different no, but you guys are the biggest club in the world, no? Yeah, we are. And we're still so what's happened? So why are you guys the biggest club in the world with small with small mindsets? Small why mindset. are you losing three 0 at home? It's because we spanked them last season. So this season, we're like, you know what? We'll give them a cheeky break, and then we come back. Give the them season. a we're cheeky like, break. Give them a cheeky break. Like you know I mean? <laughs> listen, like listen. listen. What do you think about Casemiro's performance today? Dog shit. I want. I can't lie. It was ugh, painful. Watch painful. Last week I said I was, <laughs> I was like, listen. I told all my boys I'm not watching this week. I can't. I can't sit through. Hey, appreciate that. Hey, appreciate that, Rams. Now, nah, but listen, I got two questions for you, brother. Yeah, go on. They're, 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 they're simple. They're simple. Quick fire. Go on. I asked. I asked the first one. I asked this one first. Should Ten Hag be fired? Yes. Okay. Cool. When should he be fired? See, here's the thing. I give him till December. Because oh, December. So where the no, hold up? So where should he put United? So where should United finish? Like in the table by December? Where should they be in order for I'm you to keep him? Stage, so I'm gonna be realistic. I'm saying top four, top four finish. Okay, so no, but if he's fifth, if he's fifth and just outside it, is that still good? No, fifth still Champions League spot. Okay, I mean true. I mean, but we, we have to see where you know what I'm saying. So so okay, cool. So you are so you're happy as long as he's in the Champions League spots, he can stay. And he wins a trophy. He's not like a Champions sweeps. Champions okay, League. cool. So he has to win a trophy. So yeah, so you give him to December. Cool. December. I need. I need some more progression. I need some consistency. We don't see consistency at the club no more. And it be consistent. I want good progress in Europe. I can't lose to no Spanish team in Europa League again. I'm gonna be traumatized <laughs> for life. I can't do it. Listen, I got one more question. I got one more. Where will United finish end of the season if Ten Hag is still here? Because because right now, start of the season, United fans were like, four, 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 four. How could you not put us in top four? How could you not put us in top four? Now you guys have lost two games back to back. Where do you guys think? Fifth. Fourth, fourth, fourth. I'm comfy with fourth. So you're still, so you're, you still think you're going to finish fourth? Yeah. Chat, do you agree? No, 100%. Do you guys agree? Hey, TikTok, follow up, follow up. 27 more people follow up. As a minute, yeah, winning games, well done. Mm -hmm. But they're not looking as dangerous. They're too risky in the back right now. I'm not, I'm not. Okay. So what are United looking like? Hot. Right now, risky in the back, yes. But our midfield is the issue right now. Ugarte, new signing. You know, he's coming in. We'll see some. Yeah, yeah but one of, your, one, of your, one of your signings, one of your players, Kobe Manu, was one of the ones that gave the ball away for the third goal. He, was a you guys, you know, you guys, you know, that's crazy. All the goals you guys conceded today. You gave the ball away. Yeah. Was also, in your old half, you just gave the ball away and it's a 4v2. But the thing is, at first half, Liverpool did the same thing. We didn't capitalise though. That's on us. Yeah, that's that's the separates the boys, the, the men, the like men. They played some incredible football that were blown away. No, it wasn't even like that. It was. Hey, listen, I already said it. I already said it, man. Like, you guys got issues in it. Xerxes, I don't think he's gonna be the striker you guys need. Hoyland, 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 Hoyland will be back soon, so yeah, we'll see what Hoyland does. Again, Rashford well. stinks. We all know that. No United fans can ever that hide away from that. Rashford he stinks. Picks up form, he's still top five wingers in the world. It's simple as. Picks up form, brother. It's been two seasons. He's a purple patch merchant. The last time he played good was after the what? 2023. After, was it 2023? Yeah, 2023. Yeah, 2023. That season, that year, after the World Cup ended, he was the most informed player all time. 
Something happened. Nashford is insane. Yeah, it's because he, he's broken up with his girl again. He's bro. He's he's formerly comes when he's with his girl. When he yeah. Got with her. Listen, now we now we tried that last time. He he went back with her last season. And it didn't work out anyway. And then he cheated straight away. So it doesn't matter. Huh? Huh? Yeah. I'm at Diallo's breakthrough season though. Listen, Diallo's listen, listen. But Dyer, yeah. listen. I'm gonna get the next person in here. I appreciate you. Go check out the video, bro. We'll, we'll, there's a lot of United salt that's coming tonight. <laughs> Alright, we'll see if I'm uh, all, man. Alright, who else? I see a guy called Glory. Oh fuck, I invited the wrong person. Oh fuck, who cares? The United fan anyway. Luke, actually, hold on. I see a Liverpool fan. What do you want? I want to speak to United fans. What do you want? My nan's gay. Huh? Oh, one more time. One more time for the people at the back. What did he say about his nan? What the fuck did bro just say? Ah, right, there we go. I can get the person I actually wanted to get in now. What does Zerxy do? Oh, he said his nan. Okay, cool. Okay, yo. Yeah, hello. Chat to me, brother. I see glory and I say you need United DP. What's what is up? Very good. No, 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 actually bad. Why? Well, how can it be good? Your team just lost. I said bad. Okay, yeah, good, yeah. good, good. I want I want to hear tears. I want to hear tears. Where did he go wrong? Everything. No, 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 no! Don't say everything, bro. Give me specifics. I need, I need details from the last minute detail. To what went wrong? Okay, he didn't give me, he didn't give me what I wanted. He didn't give me what I wanted. Get him out. Get him out. United for life. This guy, I, I can smell sad about United for life. He's got signed for me. Yo. Yo. Yeah, yeah. I know you got signed for me. Well, hey, hey, hey. What's your thoughts today, buddy? Oh man. I just can't believe it. This team's shit, man. Uh -huh. Allah, we need to get Casemiro out. <laughs> but wait, I thought, I thought that's five-time Champions League winner. Oh, he's so washed, man. Gallagher, Gallagher is right, man. We need uh -huh. to get him gone, man. Uh, bro, listen. They're always right when it comes to United, bro. Your team stinks. Bro, we know, man. Rashford is all. Uh -huh. It's gone, man. Well, what's, wrong with, what's wrong with Marcus Rashford? Bro, he's, I can't lie. Since what? the 22-23 season, he's been dead. After the World Cup, innit? <laughs> bro, I said this already. After the World Cup, bro, that guy's not been the same person that he used to be. Yeah, I get Right it. now, he's, he's just some next guy that I used to know, bro. He's just some guy that gets paid a lot of money, plays left wing, and chills. That's all he is. Listen. Now, now, I ask the same people the two questions. I'll ask you as well. Where's United finishing this season? Uh, I fought top four at the start of the season. After losing to Bra Bra Brighton and... Liverpool, I say fifth, oh. six, max. Maybe fifth, even mid table. Mmm. Mmm. Now my second question. Hey, hey, Matson, so so underrated. Streets won't forget. What do you mean streets won't forget about Matson? No, don't. No, let's move on. Last question, brother. Should Ten Hag be fired? Mm. More <laughs> more teeth kissed than words spoke. <laughs> That's hatred. He's angry, bro. Hey, TikTok, follow up. 25 more people, follow up. So he hits 90,700. Now, is, should Ten Hag be sacked? You always sack managers, innit? I think we give him like till December, transfer window. And if he's still shit, we need to get him gone. You wanted to get him gone in the summer, but you guys kept him. And now you guys have lost two out of three games. And all That's three true. games you played, you have not looked convincing in That's any true. of them. For Fulham, you did not look convincing, but you came out with the 1 0 win in the 86th minute. Brighton, you guys had a couple goals disallowed for offside, rightfully so. And you obviously lost to Brighton in the last minute. And now you got beat comfortably by Liverpool. So where does it so where does it go? Where is the end? Um I don't even know to be honest. Yo. Yo. Chat to me. Ah. Oh. Where did it go wrong? Where did it go wrong? For Casemiro, he just finished. So we're blaming Casemiro. Yes. Actually the I whole team was finished. No one was mo motivated to win. Huh? Listen, no listen. Was, no one was motivated to win. Listen. So is Casemiro to blame for the whole entire game? The whole everything that took place today is Casemiro just the sole person to blame? No. Who else is there to blame? Onana. Onana. Okay. You know, Onana. The goal he conceded against the second goal was insane. I hear it. Now, my question to you: Where will United finish this season? We're still getting top four. You think after watching the, the first three games of this season, you're getting top four? Yes, bro. Why? Based on what? If we have Rasmus, Ugarte, okay. Neutral, okay. a full team, okay. three players. 
those are three players. So you're telling me those three players are the difference makers. Yeah. United fans, do you agree? Hoyland comes back, even though we've watched Hoyland play the whole of last season, he did jack shit. Luke Shaw, who is your left back. But where is Malassia? Where is what's going on here? Malassia is just going. Is, is he still know. is he still pregnant? I don't think so. I Malassia, think he's training. Is Malassia still pregnant? Because he missed the whole of last year. Do you still think United finishing top four? Yeah. Yeah, God damn. All right, my last question to you, brother. Ten a hug. When is it? When is it enough? Enough. I feel like we so should keep him for this yeah. year. Yes. So let's keep him for the rest of the season and get him gone. No. Nah. Yeah. Keep him for the rest of the season. Yeah. And then reevaluate then. If he then. wins any trophies, then. Yeah, but like uh, he, yeah, but he won, the, yeah, but he won the Premier League. He won the FA. He won the FA Cup last season. You guys are still in the situation here. You're no, basically. I'm not, I'm not you know what you guys are. You know what you guys are like, right? I'll tell you guys a good comparison. Arsenal twenty twenty. Arsenal 19-18 season. That's ex exactly what I'm watching with Manchester United right now. Am I wrong? No, Arsenal was in a different re level. They no, am I wrong? No. Why, how am I not wrong? Arsenal was just horrible. Man U. Wait, hold up. Let me, no, no, let, let me finish. Arsenal in 2019-20. We had a shit season. We finished eighth. We won, the, we won the FA Cup. We got to Europa League football because we won the FA Cup. And then the next season we started... We played shit. How is it not? How is it not the same? Well, you guys believed in Arteta, huh? You Everyone, no. Arsenal fans were screaming, "Arteta is not the person to take us forward." Then why didn't they second? No, because Arsenal are like they trust for them, like. Yeah, so we trust Ten Hag. You trust Ten Hag. United fans, yes. do you guys trust Ten Hag? No, but it's between us and you. You had money. We didn't have money. We had Kroenke. He didn't want to spend. The only reason why we got the only reason why we got money out of Kroenke is because of the super. Did you see the Super League, where they tried to do that oh. that bullshit, and the Arsenal fans were like, "Get out!" And then the guy from Spotify wanted to take over. Then Kroenke was like, "Damn, people are interested in Arsenal." Then he started investing again. He brought his son Josh Kroenke to the club and said, "You look after the club." Then we started getting money in. Okay. And yeah, that's why it started. We you guys have money. It's just your money is poorly spent. This is what happens, right? You Sancho is like a 50, 60 million oh, yeah. player. Wait, wait, you bought it for 85. What's the, bad signing? What's the bad signing we made? No, I'm not talking about bad signings. I'm talking about the money that you guys have spent on players is extortionate prices. Maguire should not be going for 80 mil. San okay. Anthony, 100 mil, it should not be happening. Okay. Anthony should not be happening. You brought in Varane. Varane was a good signing, but then, um, yeah, yeah, old man got injured. Again, you guys just decided to spend a lot of money on players. Who else? Anthony, Fidget Spinner. I mean, Z Hoyland did not like come up to what you guys wanted. See, it's just bad. Just bad. I mean, Ronaldo was your best most striker, but then you guys got rid of him. I mean, yeah, Ten Hag decided. Said... It's the Glazers' fault. I mean, it's the Glazers, and is it not Ten Hag? No. So it's just the Glazers only? Yes. So I'm assuming you said that. Anything else you'd like to say about the performance today, brother? No, no. Then I'm on, bro. Listen, We'll do therapy more often for United because I feel like United fans need it, bro. It's okay, man. I'm here for you. I'm here for you, bro. Listen, listen. Oh my, listen, bro. I'm here for you, bro. Don't worry, man. I'm here for you, bro. Yeah, thank you, man. Listen. I hope your team stinks. Alright, any more United fans? Get me in, Mister Peak Fighter. Go on. Where's Mister? Is that Mister Peak Fighter? Where? Where is he? He called me Mister Peak Fighter. XX is insane. Hey, hey. Saying XX is insane, by the way. What you didn't like the kisses? No, I didn't like the kisses at all, bro. I didn't like them at all. Keep them to your goddamn oh, self. I didn't like our I, performance, so. Uh, I mean, hey, now, listen. Before we get into this, what was my what was the latest YouTube video I just posted? That's a great question, you know. You told me you did it, bro. Of course I did. Of course I did. Yeah, what was the video? So long ago, I actually liked it, but I don't remember. Yeah, what I dropped it was. the video. I dropped the video an hour ago, bro. It wasn't that long ago. <sighs> yeah, yeah, so you're lying to me. You're lying to me, but you know it is. I, 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 you, know, you know it is. You know it is. You know it is. Uh, Diva, hold up. Diva, follow my Twitch. Diva, are you even subbed to my YouTube? Of course I am. Okay, cool. What's what's my YouTube called? Peak Fighter. Yeah, fuck, I fuck off, man. That's a basic. All right, basically, right, let's get into this. The performance against Liverpool as a United fan. What did you think? Great fun to watch, really. Um, don't be wrong. I'm not worried. I'm not worried at all. You're not skeptical or scared. I mean, I don't know. We've got Ugarte to come in. You know, we'll get Casemiro shipped out. Uh -huh. 500 mil from Al, whatever. 500 mil for who? Obviously not, well, you know. I mean, the Saudis got mega money, so, you know, do we'll you see. Think, do you think they're going to come in and take 500 mil for Casemiro? 
obviously not 500 mils an exaggeration, but like, the, get like 40, 50 for him. I mean, you might get, I mean, you probably might get 30, but let us get into this. Where did it go wrong today? Casemiro, is Casemiro to blame? I mean, don't get me wrong. It's, it's very easy to scapegoat him, obviously. I mean, he gave away two goals, uh, but... You know, Bruno, Bruno had a stinker, True. absolute stinker. True. You know, Mainu looked off. He looked, he looked good the last two games. He looked off today. Yeah. Zerks, he should have had at least one, in my opinion. Uh -huh. You know, hey-ho. <laughs> Hey, so where do you think the improvements are needed for Manchester United going forward? Because currently it's I two losses out of three, and all three games you didn't look convincing. I mean, yeah, don't get me wrong. I mean, Brighton, I think we were unlucky. You yeah, know? true. You had two I mean, offside goals, but they're rightfully offside. Lose, in my opinion. We did deserve to lose, but I mean, we were unlucky, unlucky not to draw, at least. But I mean, to Brighton, I mean, that's, that's shocking anyway. I mean, we drew to Brighton. I think we drew to Brighton. But then again, yeah, we got we robbed. robbed. We got robbed. Yeah. We got robbed. Now, I've got two questions that I've been asking everyone. Where will United finish end of the season? I don't know, man. I mean, I'm not Ten Hag out by any means, but uh, I think if we get fifth and like Europa League or something, uh -huh. I mean, I'm happy with that. Okay. Which is shocking to say, but... Yeah, listen, listen you finished eighth last season, bro. Anything's an improvement right now. you got Europa League football. Yeah, we're United, man. Yeah, listen, I can't lie. You, you, see, you see the words where people used to say, we're United. I hear it. But this is not it. 2015 beforehand, yes. Since 2015, you have not been the United that I used to know. A lot of kids right now are actually growing up in a banter era. That's what's insane. Arsenal, Love. listen, that's 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 where it's bad. Do you, hey, I said to the last viewer, do you agree with what I said? United right now is basically what Arsenal were in 1920 season. We we played bad. I, I we finished. Agree. We finished. You guys finished eighth. You won the FA Cup. Then the next season, you started off poor. It basically was a bad year, but you won the FA Cup and you finished eighth. So finish, get FA Cup patched over how it was a bad year. No, I agree. We, we were very similar to Arsenal that year. But... Yeah, like it was just, you know what I'm saying? That Arsenal team was awful. So what do you describe as this United team? If that Arsenal team was awful, what's this United team? Worse, with a worse manager. Yeah. Uh, no, no, oh, oh, there you go. You, like you, so. uh, you mentioned the manager. Should Ten Hag go? No, not a chance. Not so you, so you back so you back him. All day I backed him before the FA Cup. I back him now. That's okay. So what is it? So what do you think Ten Hag needs in order to succeed? I think he's got what he needs. I think he's got Ugarte. I think we'll get Hoyland back. You know uh -huh. he's only out for what four weeks. Uh -huh. Is it? I don't remember. True. I think we'll be fine. I really think we'll be okay. Okay, we'll, we will see, brother. Okay, listen. Seven days. Seven days. bro. I appreciate you. We'll see how it goes. Alright, uh, Senor. I love you. What the fuck? the fuck? Bro, this came out and said, I love you at the end. What the fuck? <laughs> Jack. Yo. Jack, are you followed my Twitch, TikTok, and YouTube, brother? Yeah, yeah. W, W. What's the latest YouTube video I posted? Uh, 100-pound 1v1 skill challenge. Hey, let's talk, brother. What is your thoughts on United's performance against Liverpool today? Uh, we looked good in the first 20 minutes, but then every time they got on the counter, they just scored, really. Who do you blame for what took place? Ten Hag, the players, Casemiro? Uh, everyone, really. No one was really good. I mean, I, I'm looking at the United team. Maybe the Lick can keep his head held high, Masrawi, and that's about it. Yeah. yeah they Rashford were. disappeared, Garnacho got substituted, Bruno, Ghost, Xerxes, not good enough. Casemiro gave away two goals. Mainu gave away one of the goals. Martinez didn't do much. Neither did Dalo. Delic tried. Mazrawi, he tried. And then you had Onana letting in goals like that. So, what do you think is the issue with Manchester United currently? You lost two games on the bounce and you did not look convincing in all three games. I think it's the final third. I mean, sometimes you have good chances, but mm. the pass in the final third is terrible every time from the wingers. Uh, uh, uh. So... Are you trying to tell me the recruitment has been bad? Um, I've had this, I've had this discussion yeah. several times. The recruitment of Manchester United has been terrible. In you guys, school, yeah, yeah, yeah but the thing is, when United want a player, the price tag is higher because you guys are United. But I had three, I had three questions. Is it time to get rid of Casemiro? And ship him to China. Oh yeah, definitely. All right, cool. All right, cool. All right, cool. Second question. Where is United finishing this season? 
Chat, do you guys agree with him? Chat, do you guys agree with him? 12th. Okay, 8th to 12th. That's what he said. Chat, five more followers. Yeah. Chat, five more people follow. Five more people drop a follow right now. And come over to Twitch and drop a follow. Seventh, if lucky. Yes. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. All right, my last question to you, brother. Is it time for Ten Hag to be sacked? Uh, not yet, not yet. So when should when when should the question be raised? Because they were raised last season and he managed to stay yeah, that... because he won the FA Cup. What about now? Probably after the January transfer window. Okay, so you give him until January. Okay, that's half the year to see what he does. Is it panic yeah. state? Is it time to start the ringing the alarm bells? Is it panic stations at United? Yeah, at this point, yeah, three 0 at Old Trafford, lost, not not good enough. Okay, cool. All right, listen, we'll listen, we'll speak soon, brother. We'll speak soon. Don't worry. We'll, All right. It's a head held. This is therapy, bro. I'll be doing therapy for United fans. If some big team loser will do therapy, don't worry. Me, I can't lie. I'll tell you the truth and only the truth. Listen, like, all right, let's let's begin. Next viewer. Truth, nah, next, all right, let next viewer. What is your thoughts on this United performance today against Liverpool? Um, shit. Obviously, I was gonna say shit. What's... But obviously, not panic mode. I'm not gonna be panicking. You're not panicking mode. yet, brother. I feel like it's the same as if you remember two seasons ago when we started, but mm -hmm. opposite way around. If you yeah, you went on a little run. You went on a little run. Yeah. Right into what thing. True. And then we beat Liverpool. But this is the opposite. Yeah, you lost to Liverpool we won now. The first one, we lost the next two. Yeah. No panic. Our slots team was actually very good. I don't. I, I know it was shit. Uh -huh. and, but they were actually generally the way they press in that midfield is crazy. Mm. Like Toby Main is one of the most composed midfield I've seen in a long but, time. But I saw three but people I surrounded him. I saw three people surrounded him. Like That's what I'm saying. the like, press, the pressure. Was suffocating Russia. like it was peak. Well, Casemiro needs to learn Chinese and Arabic right now. <laughs> what are you trying to shit? What are you trying to say? What are you trying to say? Taiwan. Need to learn everything. Play, hey, bro's about to be playing play with. Play. Bro's about to be playing with Dwight Howard. Bro, I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you, Casemiro. What? He so, thinks he thinks he's him. That's his problem. I'll be so wrong. He won five Champions League, bro. He is him. No, but like in a sense of you had. Modric and Cruz next to you doing a passing. Uh -huh. Brother, why are you trying to do quarterback passes from in the, from like where, bro? Like, calm down. It's like these. <laughs> nah, like, listen. You weren't losing the game. We weren't winning the game. True. It was, it was like a, it was an even game. And then you're trying to do like these dumb retarded passes from nowhere. <laughs> so it's just listen. like, it doesn't make sense to me. Listen, listen, listen. I've, I've got two questions in it. I've got two questions. Should go Ten Hag be sacked? I can't lie. Not yet, but he. How long? Thing, how long? How long? On one thing. Uh -huh. it's, it's not even how long. If he carries on one more thing, then I think that games he gets that next game. If he uh -huh. carries yet on consistently starting Rashford, because I don't know what he's seen in him generally. Because okay. this this thing of starting Rashford because he's your your star boy, sound like the guy's not a star boy anymore. He's like twenty. He's like thirty. <laughs> like calm down. <laughs> the guy he hasn't been good for over a year. Like you need to just be like God Nacho. Is playing on the right for for Rashford. Diallo is getting benched for Rashford when they're both better than him. It doesn't make sense. Hey. Like, bench the guy, leave him alone. Like we should have sold hey. the PSG when we had the chance. Honestly, we should have sold him. So, 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 him so you so you so you've had enough of said individuals in this team. So Casemiro so, got a goal. Only, so, Cas only two. so Casemiro the got a goal. Team is fine. So, Casemiro, team so Casemiro and Rashford got a goal. Yeah, they gotta go. Can't lie. They're the pro genuinely. If you watch the game, Rashford didn't want to take on a single. He was scared of Trent. It doesn't make sense. Why is Trent can't defend? Why is he scared? <laughs> All right, listen. I got one. Uh, Rashford was so good, bro. That is said, but that Rashford when he first came into the scene, then he took a little dip. Don't forget, he took a dip for two seasons. Then he came back in the World Cup after the World Cup. I started bagging. Then dipped again. He's, 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 he's dipped again. Last season he didn't do shit. He's, he's dipped. That he's dipped. The truth, oh, my honest he keep, why, does, why is he such a purple patch? And I don't want to hear this. I don't want to hear this. I don't want to hear this bullshit though. Now, I, hear, I hear people keep saying he left his girlfriend left. No, 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 no. I'll tell you the real reason. What? And it, it'll be facts. When people hear it, it'll be facts. What? You see why Foden is way better than Rashford and Saka is way better than Rashford? Why? Why? Because the, the development. They had one manager on their back. Rashford had to go through Jose Mourinho. Louis Van Gaal. These are different play, different managers with different systems. You can't develop as a young player with so many different managers. It's impossible, bro. When they're changing formation, changing system, that's where it flipped up for Rashford. Because Rashford's ability 
as in the way he runs, the, everything is good. We just don't got a man. He just never had. I mean, Sa- Saka had Emery for like what a season that he had yeah, Arteta until one now. And then, I mean, I hear it. I hear it. Made him way better. So you're trying to say Rashford? You're trying to say Rashford's corrupted? He's done. He got bro, he got corrupted, and then he, they gave him three hundred fifty k a week. Nah, nah bro. Nah, nah, bro. You know what happened when you have soft someone like that? It's Abamyang. Remember, he started partying, and he got dropped. Abamyang. Abamyang. Rashford just thinks he's cool. I'm saying, take his chain away, take his glasses away, take everything. Bro, there's a reason his girlfriend. Okay. Like, he knew oh much. dear. Okay. Is can Rashford get back to his best, or is he done? In United, no, he needs to leave United. He needs to go fresh environment where the, the light is not constantly on him whenever he does a stinker. Okay, cool. I got he one. Go join me in real, then <laughs> say I'll be sorrow. Hey, I got one more question before I get the next person. Go on. Where is Manchester United playing like the way they are now? Where would they finish? Me, as I said, no panic mode. There's still washed teams like Tottenham and Chelsea out there, so you know I mean, what I'm saying. Chelsea, but both them teams have won more games. Actually, no way, hold no. up, Tottenham, Tottenham, Tottenham hasn't. Tottenham, Tottenham, Tottenham hasn't. Haven't. Tottenham got more points. No, I think Tottenham have maybe. Tottenham got four. Now, Tottenham drew to Leicester. Easy opponent. Easy like, opponent. If we reverse the likes of Ipswich and Everton, we'll beat them too, trust me. Okay, but this is my point. True. Let me tell you, Man United, they might. You know how you talk about the 2018, 2019, or the 2019, 2020? Yeah. When you guys barely made it. Yeah. Top four, yeah. When you guys literally lost in the last, I think that's going to be United. You did that long, but you didn't know. You guys did that last season. What last season? No, I'm talking about Arsenal. Yeah, Arsenal 20, 2019, 2020, We finished eighth and we got um top four. So we got what eighth and we got your plea. The next season when you got eighth again. We got, eight, we got eighth again. What was the season that you guys barely, you guys had free you lost three games in the right at the beginning? Oh, that's twenty eight. That's that's eighteen nineteen. That's Emery. 18. And then we and then we and then we, and then we it was and then we lost the Europa League final. No, it's not that one. I'm talking about the one that you guys lost your first three games and then you barely made the top four. Hey, one more of you guys follow up and we hit ninety five seven hundred. Oh, he left. Okay, man. All right, cool. Yeah, boy. Cool. Follow up. Follow up. Yo. Yo. Chat to me, bro. What was your thoughts on today's performance? Um. Wait. To be honest, what? I'm a Liverpool fan. Hey, bro. Why? Why the fuck are you here? Say your piece. Say your piece. Say your piece. Okay. Okay. Say your piece. Basically. I think United weren't that bad, like, in the start. Uh-huh. But to be honest, like, Maynou and Casemiro. Uh-huh. Casemiro's gone, man. He's done. Listen, listen, yeah. listen, 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 my brother. Where do you think Liverpool are going to finish? Because I'm going to get United fans in here. Then I'm gone. I've been alive for six hours. I'm going to get so United fans. Listen, if Liverpool lose, I'll, I'll therapy session for Liverpool fans. But today, you know what I'm saying? So, where's Liverpool finishing? To be honest, at the start, I thought no title charge. But mm-hmm. after that. I think that title is on. Title charge is on. Yeah. All right, listen. We'll speak soon, gang. We'll speak soon. I right, right, guess what? I'll be the title trace. Will you? We'll see. We'll yeah. see. All right, all right, chat. All right, chat. Uh, we're back again to the same stage. One more person. Follow up. If you're new here and you haven't done so already, press that follow button. One more person, and then we're done. Shit, my TikTok. Twenty-one, twenty-two. It was twenty-one, twenty-two. Arsenal. That's it. All right, last one. Press that follow button if you have not done so already. Yo. Yo, yo, yo. Listen, uh, what teams do you support? Support United. Chat to me, bro. Listen, you're the last person today. What's your thoughts right, on so what happened? Team, yeah. Honestly, I'm going to be straight up honest. We have no oh. chemistry. I, I hear it. You know what it is? I actually can see it when you guys play. Because we have Bruno uh-huh. going for goals for no reason. But Bruno's a bit too egotistical to me, to be fair. He, he thinks he's like Ronaldo. He can't bro, he, he, he thinks he's Thanos. But realistically, he's not really Thanos. He's Bruno Fernandes. At this rate, we're going to finish sixth. Actually, you know what it is? I hear it. Because you know what it is about United, right? No, but the thing is with United, this is what could happen. Do you remember when United last season, right? You guys had the most easiest running on all time. Yeah, yeah. And then after when they had that running, they lost to how many teams? Brentford, all of them, man. They just started losing, losing, losing to everyone. Exactly. And then, yeah. And then, so, so I've got, I got, I got these two questions for you, brother. Do you, oh, hold on, three questions. Do you blame Casemiro today? I don't blame him. Oh, okay. That's 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 that I knew. I, I blame him for the first goal. First goal, I blame him. Okay. What about the second? Second, second, second was a foul. Yeah, second was a second foul. Yeah. The foul. But, we're, we're, listen, it's subjective. To me, it was weak. Like, for example, you can say the same about Kobe Mainu. You could say that was a foul, but no one said nothing about that one. Exactly. Everyone, just, everyone just say he got surrounded. So, it, I, to me personally, it was not a foul. But it is what it is. It was football. 
Leave football. Hey, may you not have finished. Leave football before the football leaves you. That's like, that's not like something for fucking Casemiro. Exactly. But my two questions. Exactly. Like, I have two questions about Manchester United. Where would they finish this season? This season, seventh or sixth. Seventh. Oh, that's oh, that's a bit bad. Oh, all right. My last question. Ten Hag. Yeah. When is it time to hang it up? When is it time to hang up the the suit? I say enough is enough. I can't take this project any further. I think at the end of the season. Well, I'll be I'll be honest. He started to get in his players, so the back line is basically his. The back line, apart from Dalo, he didn't bring in Dalo. The back line, three of them are his. Actually, he brought in Martinez. Did he bring in Martinez? Yeah. He brought in Martinez. Yeah. He brought in Delict, and he brought in uh, he brought in a goalkeeper. He brought in uh, Mazraoui. He brought in Casemiro. He was the one that brought in um, Colby from the from the obviously he brought him in. He brought in um, Garnacho, obviously. He, he got him in the starting lineup. The team is near enough his. Yeah, so the excuses, the excuses has to go. There's no excuses anymore. In my opinion, the team is a Ten Hag team. Before it wasn't because he used to have Maguire and them man playing. There's no more excuses no more. This is Ten Hag's team. Yeah. So when is it time to hang it up? Maybe one more season after this. Maybe that's it.
Alright man, good night man. Peace.